Hello, it's Dr. James and Dr. Kaylee Judge. We are the co-founders of Judge Wellness, and we just want to talk to you today about our next cycle event coming up here. It is called Body Armor. And it, we're really trying to help people increase their immunity from the inside out. And I think that a lot of people don't really have a clear definition of what your immune system truly is. So, Dr. Kaylee, what is the immunity? What is the immune system? Your immune system is like soldiers coming out into war to attack those things that are trying to invade your system. So you have this whole system that is ready to defend anything that gets into your body. So we're talking about germs, we're talking about bacteria, viruses, things like that. You have a natural immunity that's already set up in your body. We just have to make sure that it's working and it's ready to actually go after and attack that. So what is the difference between natural immunity and artificial immunity? Good question, and this can be a really lengthy discussion, but we'll just keep it as simple as we can for right now. So if we talk about artificial immunity, artificial immunity would be something that you're putting from the outside of your body and putting it into your body to create some sort of immunity. But really that's just creating a more of a defensive wall that your body has to um, heighten its own natural immunity. Because what happens is, is over time it actually starts to shut down when you have an artificial immunity. But when your body is able to create a natural immunity, it stays with you throughout your lifetime, it builds up, it creates you to be even stronger. That's why we see so many kids in the office that are getting adjusted. We've got families of five, six, seven um, that come in when they're sick. We highly encourage our patients to come in when they're sick and they, they get their adjustments because we know that after every single adjustment, your body is actually boosting its immune system by 200%, which is an incredible amount. What would a, a symptom of a immune system response be? Because a lot of people are scared of those symptoms, like high fevers and diarrhea and vomiting. What are those things actually doing to your body to help you and not hurt you? That is what is allowing your soldiers to go out and fight. You know, both of us, we know, we've grown up with no vaccinations. We've never been to a medical doctor. We never took drugs. We never took medications. When you and I got sick, our uncles would come over and they would adjust us laying in bed and making sure that our immune system would be boosted. So we've been brought up to honor and to make, make sure that our bodies have the ability to heal. So when I say honor the body's ability to heal, I'm talking about if you have a fever, yeah, it's okay to monitor to see where it's at, but you always wanna just let it ride its course because that's your body's immune system really attacking whatever type of infection it's got yeah. happening and it's got going on. For me, when I get sick, right, because we don't like to stay sick, it's expressing symptoms of health, right. and that's how you should look at it. When I get a fever, I actually want to amplify that fever. So I have a sauna in my house that I go into and amplify it, because I know that that fever is going to kill the bacteria, or kill the virus that's trying to hurt me and harm me. Your body is designed and works that way. That's how God invented your body, you know. It raises your natural immunity by increasing your temperature in the body. And there's a huge cascading effect that happens, right? Your CD4 cells increase, your natural killer cells start to come out and find those bacterial viral infections. So it's a huge, awesome thing that happens. So yeah, Dr. James, just like you were talking about raising your temperature, I remember as kids when, when you and I would have fevers or have get, get that sickness or start expressing symptoms, mom and dad would put us in sweatpants yep. and wrap us in, in blankets to make sure that our, our temperature got even higher. And there's actually a great way to do this if you've got kids at home, is to put them in a bath and put in some lemon slices. What that's gonna do is help to actually get that core temperature of your body to raise and get through it even faster. So I'm not talking about decreasing your temperature, I'm actually talking about spiking it to get that infection fighting over with quicker. Now the number one thing that can affect your immune system is your nerve system. So for us, first thought when we got sick was get adjusted. And many of us when we get sick our spine has shifted out of alignment causing pressure at the top bone here and that is your immune system bone. That's the the atlas. It's where the immune system speaks through. That's the brain communicating to the body. So that is where we look to first to adjust. We move that bone, take the pressure off the nerve system so your brain can go to work and do exactly what it needs to do. That's the first thing. Then you increase the temperature and do all of the other stuff naturally to help your body's immune response. So again, if you're sick, that's exactly why you should increase your visits, not decrease your visits right. to the chiropractor. 
You should get adjusted more, not less. I don't care if you're puking or have diarrhea, bring a bucket and wear a diaper. Because for me, that's exactly what I do. And I've never had to have those medications before in my life. Neither has Dr. Kaylee. And um, it's not a coincidence that we've never had to do that. It's because we understand how the body works. And if you get that, you get the big idea. All else is going to follow. So during this cycle, it's called Body Armor. We're having an amazing event coming up on July 27th. It's at 645 in St. Charles at the Hickory Knolls Discovery Center. We want to invite you, your family, and your friends. This is a free event for the public and bring as many people as you can. We're expecting to have over 200 people there for this event because it is such a hot topic. We want to invite everybody in our community to be there. So um, again, 645 on July 27th at the Hickory Knolls Discovery Center. So we do this for you, we do this for your family, and we do this for your future. Power's on.